Let's work this out. The integral from 0 to 1, and here we have u plus 2 times u minus 3. Well, this u is going to be affected by that u, so we should multiply this out first. So we'll do that. So I'll just do the usual foiling. We still have the integral though, integral from 0 to 1, and u times u is of course u squared, and I take u times negative 3, that's negative 3 u, and we will get 2u from here, so positively 2u. Um, negative 3 u combined with 2u, we get negative u, so we have minus u right here. At the end, neg um, positive 2 times negative 3, that's of course negative 6. Put the du on the side. This part right here is a part that we have to do the antiderivative first. So, derivative of what will be u to the second power? Do the power rule backwards. Add 1 divided by 3, divided by 2 plus 1, which is 3. So we have u to the third power over 3. Next one, minus u to the first power, I add 1 to the exponent, 1 plus 1 is 2. So divided by 2, we have minus u squared over 2. And this one, minus 6, I just need to attach a u on the side. That's it. That's the antiderivative for that. And now I have to take care of the numbers. You don't need to worry about the plus c, because the c will cancel out if you subtract each other. So we have from 0 to 1, and this is like the whole expression right here. Plugging 1 into all the u's, so we are going to get 1 to the third power over 3 minus 1 squared over 2 minus 6 times 1, like this. And this is like the first part after we plug in 1 into all the u's. Well, we have to plug in 0 into all these u's. Minus 0 to the third power. I know it's going to be 0, but let me just show you guys the work, okay? So 0 squared over 2 minus 6 times 0. It's a good habit to show work. Anyways, all this right here, it's 0, so that's very nice. And now we have to struggle with fractions right here. Um, this is 1 third, of course. This is minus 1 half, of course. And this is minus 6, of course. And let's get a common denominator for all these things. Um, the common denominator will be 6. So let me put a 6 as a 6 over 1. I will need to multiply by 2 right here. Multiply by 3 right here. And multiply by 6 right here. Okay? So the common denominator will be 6. And what's on the top? This is 2 minus 3, which is negative 1. Minus 36. Negative 1 minus 36 will give you negative 37. That's it.